Well, friends, on behalf of the party, NPP, I would like to convey my sincere gratefulness and thank thankfulness to all the voters in the state of Meghala who once again has deci decided to vote in favor of the my party, NPP party, and also to have faith and confidence once again under the leadership of Sri Konrad Sangma for this general election which has just concluded a few days back. And number two, I would like to also mention here with great concern about what has happened last night. We have seen it. There were few groups of people, which I should say miscreants, unknown miscreants, who trying to create law and order in the Shillong city, and especially in the relatives' house of those elected <coughs> representatives. One is from Mount Harashan, and the other one is from Mount Shandor, which is very, very unfortunate. It seems these people trying to snatch away the constitutional right of the elected representative. So the message, therefore, is very clear. We will not allow such criminal activities to happen in the entire state of Meghala. Just because of one party or one individual MLA wanted to join to any political party for forming the government, I think this is against the constitution and against the right of the people of those concerned constituencies. So it is my appeal to all concerned from now on, they have to stop this and the government will take all out effort to make sure that the culprit be booked at the earliest possible. Number two, there are few NGOs like HITO and HYC. Seems they link themselves, or I should say, it seems they are political wing of some political, political parties. Because openly, whenever they go to any places within the Khasi Jaintia, they talk openly that we should vote this party or that party. So, see, I think NGOs are not supposed to involve in the political process directly. Indirectly, yes, you have every right to vote, you have every right to do whatever you want inside you. You, do, you need not come out openly that don't vote in favor of this party or that party which I personally feel this is totally wrong again. So people need to understand, people need to know exactly who are this group doing all this. And I'm, I'm very sure the people of the state knows better than anybody else. But once again, my concern is very, very clear. Let me tell you, we have already instructed the police force to make sure that law and order is maintained at any cost, especially before the swearing-in ceremony, which is going to be held on the 7th of this month in the morning time. So this, this, this is my, my appeal to all the concern, to all the, uh, the, uh, to all the political parties. Let us work together. Well, people has already elected you. No matter, you will be in the opposition or you will be in the, in the government, but we will work together for the betterment of our, our state here. <coughs>